most important asset for any company is its people. To improve their businesses, companies often focus on improving people's work skills and processes, but overlook measures to encourage people to improve their health. Excess weight is associated with many health risks like heart disease, high blood pressure, and diabetes, to name a few. According to a 2011 study, 90% of truck drivers in the U.S. are now considered overweight, with a body mass index above 24. Truck drivers are all too familiar with the challenges of weight control due to the nature of their sedentary job and limited options for exercise when they're on the road. Poor diet, long periods of time away from home, and the normal stresses of the job can make lifestyle changes challenging. But some changes are clearly needed, and they help make a difference in the lives of our team members. The Tyson Foods Transportation Team has decided to join the TCA's 2012 Trucking Weight Loss Showdown. We encourage all of our drivers who want to participate and lose weight. In addition to the psychological benefits that come with losing weight, appearance, accomplishment, self-esteem, there are numerous physical benefits too. Increased mobility, reduced stress, and more energy. In some cases, reversal of life-threatening conditions has occurred for some people who have lost weight, reducing or eliminating the need for certain medications. Remember that study I mentioned at the beginning? Well, it's also revealed that 30% of the drivers that have high blood pressure and 11% have diabetes. The average life expectancy of a truck driver is now 61 years, which is 16 years less than the average person. If through participating in the 2012 Trucking's Weight Loss Showdown, just one driver is able to make a life-altering change in their health, then it will all be worth it. I'm excited for this opportunity that presents for our team members to participate and hope that they are able to inspire others to live a healthier lifestyle. I've struggled with my weight since I was 35 years old. It uh, seems the older I get, I uh, gain a little more weight all the time. I have uh, tried eating habits, exercise. I've probably lost a, a ton of weight in my lifetime and uh, it kind of slowly comes back each time it seems like. so. My goal for this program is to lose 25 to 30 pounds over the 10 week period. Uh, and after that period is, is when the program's done, I'd like to continue on and lose another 60 to 70 pounds, get my weight down to where, uh, to where it used to be in the 240s to 250 range and become healthier, maybe uh, become non-dependent on my uh, uh, hypertension medicine and to live a healthy life and, and a, an older life and a healthy life. Losing weight is important to me for my health reasons mostly, and uh, I've got granddaughters that I want to be around to, to see grow up, graduate school. Uh, I've got high blood pressure, gout, and I need to get my weight under control to, to improve my health. I've tried everything. I've tried just uh, changing my eating habits on my own. I've tried uh, lots of different things, but I've also tried uh, uh, slim fast diets. I've tried, I'm a lifetime member of Jenny Craig diet. Uh, I've tried Weight Watchers. Uh, I've just not had no luck with any of it. I'd like to lose, in the 10 week period, I'd like to lose 40 to 50 pounds. Uh, I know that's gonna take a lot, but I'm willing to put out that, uh, what it needs to be done to do it. And then I'd like to bring my goal weight down to about 280. Uh, after that, just keep going with it. You know, I've been a big girl my entire life. I played all kinds of sports, and I was a weightlifter, biker, played every sport there is to play, and I never really struggled with weight at that point. It was when I got a job, worked lots of hours, quit playing sports, quit riding my bike, and I kept eating the same as I always ate when I was active. So if I lost 20 pounds, I'd be extremely happy. Anything I lose over that to me is going to be a bonus. But I am looking forward to the coaching. And I've heard really good things about the program and the foods. So I'm hoping that it is easy for me to stick with. And they told me that they would tell me some exercises that are good for truck drivers to use. And I'm really looking forward to that too.